Let's have a girl chat. Good morning, I just washed my face and brushed my teeth. Today is going to be kind of a chill vlog. We're going to do some spring cleaning, um, self-care, and basically spend the Saturday with me. Alright, I've changed to something a little bit more decent. Not too decent. <laughs> I microwaved some leftovers that we had from um, this restaurant called Danvan Polcha. If you watched Itaewon class, you might kind of recognize the name. They're a restaurant inspired by that K-drama and um, they're pretty good. Their soup used to be my favorite, but it got a little bit salty the last two times that I went. But it's usually really good. They have really good chicken and squid and things like that. I'm sitting at my computer desk to eat this because we don't have actual dining seats or anything like that. Our kitchen is really small. So I sit out here to eat. Mm. This is um, army stew. I think they call it army stew. And it has like spam, tofu, veggies, kimchi. And a bunch of other stuff. I really like it. I love soups so much. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Also, I don't know if I'll wear makeup for my video today. I know you'll probably think that I don't have to, but sometimes I feel like I have to look perfect in order for people to watch stuff. And I don't want to do that anymore. I feel tired. I want to just be myself, be loved and appreciated as myself. So yeah. Recently, um, I finished this K-drama called Flower of Evil. It was really, really good. Kind of like a thriller mystery. Is it? Is it mystery? Considered mystery? Um, I'm not sure, but basically this psychopath guy, he marries a detective and a bunch of stuff happens. I don't want to give away too much. I don't like spoiling stuff for people, but yeah, it was really, really good. What else have I been watching? I've been watching Vincenzo. I think a lot of people are watching that as well. That one has been a roller coaster too. What else? I watched the Demon Slayer movie in theaters. It was so, so good. I just love watching shows and movies and stuff. I don't know, that's my life. My nails kind of matching the flowers. Okay, I'm back. My camera ran out of battery for a quick second. So I fell down this rabbit hole on TikTok, but we are back. And now I'm going to start to clean. Finally, we're getting into this little area. Most of the things in this little area are PR packages or things that I don't put away and I kind of throw over here. We're about to go through it and see what we have. Oh, I love these. These are from Erin Condren. They are stationary like Sanrio and like Hello Kitty things. These are like postcards that I can mail off with envelopes. This cute pen, which I'm just going to open right now because I don't have very many pens and I keep losing them. So because this one is cute, I hope I don't lose it. I have this. It is a daily kindness and joy journal. I was really excited to use this because I love doing this type of things in the morning. Small kindness, medium kindness. Big kindness, small joys and big joys of the day. I find it really fun to journal and then maybe like read them a year from now and see where my head was at from a year ago. It's really interesting actually. Definitely going to use this so I'm just going to set it aside here. Go ahead and open this. This is a really cute pouch. I can keep my pencils and things in here. Post-it notes. This is a stationary dream. More journals. It's so cute. I'm just going to need a little designated spot for all my stationary stuff. 
I might keep some of this in the plastic because I don't know if I can use all of it. So it would be nice if I could save it and use it a year from now and not have it ruined or anything like that. Next, I got a little PR package from To All The Boys, the, the movie on Netflix. And it's really cute. I got a little bit of face mask and they gave me this. Let me show you what it looks like. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and clean all this stuff. I'll be right back. Okay, so it is a little bit neater. I mean, it's still a little bit messy, but I know what's over there. So I think it's pretty clean. It's mostly just my like arts and craft, um, mostly like sewing stuff and extra um, backstock stuff. I did find this hot chocolate bomb thing and I want to um, actually make it right now. Got my hot chocolate here. Mm, it tastes really good. This is my relaxing time. If you follow me on Instagram, you can probably see me sit here a lot. I'm just sitting on the floor and um, looking out the window. It's the only light source I have in my apartment. So if I want good lighting, it has to be here. Yeah, it's still a little bit too hot. I'm just going to hold it and wait for a little bit. So this is how I usually spend my Saturdays. I wonder what everyone else does. Go shopping or go eat. Like what else can you do besides that? I feel like I'm not that creative nowadays and I like to just stay home. I do like to go out too, but I don't have like a lot of ideas on what to do, especially the way it is now. I don't know, I don't know what to do when I go outside. I really don't. Besides taking pictures, that's like my hobby. I love taking pictures. So far today has been very relaxing for me. Drinking one of your favorite drinks and having like some quiet time and um, just sitting alone is so therapeutic for me. I think like that's part of my self-care routine. An ideal self-care day for me is to have a clean home, so clean up. Um, I can only handle cleaning one area a day though because it can be too much so i guess like maybe cleaning up just one little spot having my favorite drink and getting some alone time some peace and quiet shopping man i love shopping <laughs> hopefully my package comes today so maybe i can show you what i've got or maybe i can do like a spring haul video and show you some of the things i bought recently what else I would love to get in some exercise and maybe sew some of my clothes and some journaling and um, some time to watch my favorite shows. That's a lot, right? I feel like as long as I'm not on my phone and scrolling, um, it's very doable. Mm. It is really good. Let's have a girl chat. I wanna talk about how I'm trying to be a better friend to myself this year. I feel like in the past, well, the past and even now, I've been a really, really good friend to a lot of people, but I'm never a good friend to myself. I'm really hard on myself and like, whenever someone hurts me, I try to like forgive them and like push all my feelings aside. And I'm just like, why, why do I do that? Like, if people hurt me, I should be able to, I should be able to speak up and say, hey, I'm hurt. But in the past, I'm like noticing a pattern where I, see that they've hurt me and I like try to forgive them. I mean, which is which is good, but they never even like apologize to me, never say anything and I don't say anything to them because I just be knowing, but I don't I don't really say it out loud. So yeah, I'm trying to practice my boundaries. Like just getting older. I know a lot of you think that I'm young, but I turned 28 this year, so a lot of stuff happened, a lot of trauma, and I'm trying to heal myself this year. I'm trying to take better care of myself, accept myself and understand myself and love myself. That got deep really quick, I'm so sorry. Let's enjoy this. Okay, I changed into my workout clothes so that I can get a workout done. I'm trying to follow one of Chloe Ting's program and I think that I wanna do the the get peachy challenge. I feel like I've been sitting down too much and my booty is getting flat because of that. I finished all my workouts. Chicken. I have carrots and chicken and some, some greens. I don't know what those are. They're also from Dunbum, so 
not the carrot, but the but the chicken. The chicken is one of my favorite dishes at Dan Bon Pocha. So if you're in New Jersey, you should definitely go visit them. Mm. They put some type of sauce on the chicken and the greens and it makes it really good. I don't know what it is. I've been trying to figure out what I can do to make that sauce at home. Mm -mm -mm -mm. After eating, I'll probably shower and then I'm supposed to have dinner with my boyfriend and his mom and auntie tonight. So I might get ready for that. At least look a little bit decent to see them. I just finished showering. I am definitely not putting on any makeup today. <laughs> it's already late in the day. I feel like I'm going to let my skin breathe. Um, we're just going to put on something very casual and simple and call it a day there. All right, I think that is all for today. I'm going to rest up and later go to dinner. I will see you guys next time.